What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley for those who are new here. Hello and welcome and for all of my returning subscribers. Hey girl. So today I am going to be doing a little bit of memory keeping. This is not something that I normally do so I'm going to savor you guys and not talk through the entire process but rather just bring you guys along with me as I go through things. So this will be a sped through video. Um, so yeah. I have a few things here that I've already kind of prepared. I have some photos from a trip that I recently took. It was a solo trip. It was the first one that I ever did. I just went to Ann Arbor, Michigan, which is just a few hours away from where I live, which is central Ohio. Um, so I have this postcard, which I knew I specifically would want to use for like some memory keeping. So I made sure to grab that. I have some scrap paper here that I went on ahead and pre-punched and cut down to size. Um, I have these washies here, but I also picked a few other ones that I may want to use on the side here. And then I've recently been collecting some things from, um, from Amazon just like some journaling pages or not pages, but journaling papers and, you know, more decorative scrapbooking type paper, little washies and stuff like that. So I want to try to use some of this stuff. I have this pack here, which is like, you know, postage themed. So let me pull out some of that and I can kind of show you. I just think all of this stuff is kind of cute and I would like to get into like, you know, using these sort of things when I'm doing like, you know, more creative type things in my planner. I'm not exactly sure where these pages are going to live in my planner just yet, but we're going to figure it out as we go. So if you guys want to see how I just create some fun memory keeping pages, definitely stay tuned.
All right, you guys, this is the completed project here. I love the way that this turned out using all of the using all of the different types of mediums. I felt like, you know, I really found a groove and a style as to how I wanted to use this. So, or use all the things I should say. So obviously we have like a little cover page here. I will write the dates that I was in Michigan and then you open it up and I have like just these two little clusters of photos. I did have two more photos that I can add in, but I did want to leave some space to journal what all I had going on on these days or just how I was feeling. So I ended up putting in one last photo, which I was kind of on the fence whether or not I wanted to share, but look how beautiful that is. I had to share. So this trip for me was all about getting back in tune with myself and self-love and all of that stuff. And if this photo don't say just that, baby, I was very much proud of this moment right here. So that's like my final page. And then I just popped it in like basically where the currently page would be in my September layout or in my September catch all. So that is right there. And like, this is the first thing that I see. I love, I love, I live. And I love this quote. It says, don't just wake up and think about the woman you want to become wake up and be her and then like these little nice little quotes it says you are your only limit and be bold baby yes that's what we were doing so hopefully you guys enjoyed watching me go through this process if you guys did please make sure that you hit this with a thumbs up um if you want to see more of this definitely let me know down in the comment section below i'm just trying out some new things and like just being more creative in my planners. So if you like this, let me know. And if you enjoy the channel, make sure that you go on ahead and hit the subscribe button as well as the bell notification. That way you are notified every single time I upload a new video. This is all for this video. I thank you guys so much again for stopping by. And until the next time, I wish you all health, wealth, and prosperity. Peace out.